Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to Championship Prediction. There's a few surprising results this weekend. Um, but before we get down to all that, this video is sponsored by LOL T-Shirt Company. They do sell my merch. The link for my merch is down in the description below. So guys, feel free to check it out after watching this video. Um, but anyway, let's get down to these fixtures. Um, so guys, anyway, you know what I do. So guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and let's go. So the first game we're going to talk about is Millwall versus Luton Town. Um, let's go over to the results first of all. Millwall beat Brentford 1-0 at home. And um, Luton Town losing 3-0 away to Bristol City. Bit of a surprising result overall if you think how Bristol City have been playing the past uh, few weeks. Um, let's go over to the table. Luton are in 23rd. Um, Millwall are in 11th. This game could probably be like, one-sided. But if you looked at my last week's predictions, you would have seen what I said about I think it's West Brom versus Barnsley last week. Um about like the top teams go I think they're gonna beat the bottom teams and it don't work out that way. Um so as far as this result goes, I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Birmingham versus Wigan Athletic. Let's go to the results first of all. Wigan losing 1 0 away to Nottingham Forest. Um, Birmingham losing to Leeds 5 4 at home. Um, great game that Leeds to Birmingham result. Birmingham were very unfortunate not to get the point. Um, on the Wigan point of view, um, you know, losing. Losing. Um, 1-0 away to Nottingham Forest. That's not a bad result from a Wigan perspective. Okay, you got no points, but it won't, you know, a big score. But going forward for Wigan this weekend against Birmingham. Now, yet again, I'm looking at the lead table. Um, Birmingham on the 17th, Wigan on 24th. I'm going to call this one a draw, and I'm going to go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Bristol City versus Brentford. Um, Bristol City beating Luton 3 0 at home. Great three points for Bristol City. Very much needed to get the three points back to hopefully put them back on the winning trail. Um, Brentford losing 1 0 away to Millwall. This point day for Brentford, currently sitting in fourth by the skin of their teeth. Um, literally just a point between Brentford and fourth. Nottingham Forest in 5th, Sheffield Wednesday in 6th, and Preston who are in 7th who just came out of the playoff places. Um, yeah, again, going forward for this game, I mean, you've got Bristol City who had just won their first game out 5. Um, so, you know, it's, it's going to perfectly got to be a bit of an interesting game. Um... Going forward, I'll go for a 2-2 scoreline for that one. My next one is Fulham versus Reading. Um, Fulham beating Stoke 1-0 at home. A big three points, I think that was for Fulham there. Reading beating Preston North End 2-0 away from home. Great three points for Reading. Big three points for Reading as well. Um, yet again... How's this one going to plan out? I'm going to go for a Fulham win, just about. And I'm going to go for a 2-1 Fulham win. My next one is Huddersfield versus Stoke City. Um, Huddersfield beating Blackburn 2-1 at home. Um, very big three points for Huddersfield there. Stoke losing one nil away from home to Fulham. Um, so yet again, this game bottom of the table clash. Yeah, Stoke in twenty first, Huddersfield are in nineteenth. Um, but Stoke won twenty one points. Huddersfield won twenty eight. Huddersfield 
Um, obviously won their last game and Stoke finally won their one out of the three last games where this Huddersfield really have done two wins out of the last three games. So, you know, going confidence wise with this game, Huddersfield have probably just a bit more confidence. Um, but I'll go for a 2 0 Huddersfield Town win for that one. My next one is Nottingham Forest versus Blackburn Rovers. Um, Nottingham Forest beating Wigan 1 0 at home. Blackburn losing. 2-1 uh, away to Huddersfield, away from home. So Nottingham Forest, how are they doing? How are they, do they won their last two. Um, Blackburn, you know, down in 13th now and lost just one out of the last five games. Um, yeah, again, going forward um, for this one, considering Notts Forest have won their last two, I'm going to go for a Notts Forest win, and I'm going to go for a 3 now Nottingham Forest win. My next one is Preston North End versus Middlesbrough. Um, Preston losing 2-0 at home to Reading. Um, Middlesbrough beating West Brom 2-0 away from home. Big three points for the Borough there. Um, but great three points for Borough as well. Um, yeah, again... Going into this game, you've got Preston that's on a really down. They ain't, ain't won a game out of their last three um, results. Middlesbrough, um, you know, they've won their last three. So I'm going to go for a Middlesbrough win. And I'm going to go for a 2-1 Middlesbrough win. My next one is Queen's Park Rangers versus Cardiff. Um, Queen's Park Rangers... Losing to Hull 2-1 at home. Um, so, you know, very much, um, you know, gunning unconfidently maybe this game. Um, Cardiff beating Sheffield Wednesday 2-1 away from home. Big three points for Cardiff. Um, going forward again with this game, I'm going to look at QPR on the table. So they have not won in their last four. Um, Cardiff, they have won their last, in their last four. Um, literally this game just gone. But how tight it is between the two clubs. I'm going to call this one a draw. And I'm going to go for a 2-2 scoreline for that one. My next one is Sheffield Wednesday versus Hull City. Um, Sheffield wins, they lose the 2-1 at home to Cardiff. Um, and um, Hull City losing... Uh, sorry, Hull City winning 2-1 at home, away from home, sorry, against QPR. I'm going to quit by the draw, and I'm going to go for a one on scoreline for that one. My next one is West Brom and Jalbia versus Leeds United. Top two clash. Um, who will be top of the table at the end of this game? I'm going to call this one. I'm going to say a West Brom win. And I'm going to go for a 2 0 West Brom win. My next one is Derby County versus Barnsley. Um, Derby County still yet to play as I'm recording this. Barnsley nil nil against Swansea City. Great point for Barnsley and just literally a point of safety. Um, going forward, um, I'm going to go for a Barnsley win and I'm going to go for a 2 nil Barnsley win. My next one and my last one is Swansea City versus Chatham Athletic. Chatham Athletic still yet to play. Swansea nil nil um, at home to Barnsley. Yet again, going forward, I'll go for a chat and win, and I'll go for a two nil chat and win. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. So big fun, hope you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.